Hi, I'm Heiko Blair. How many of you would like to have a beautiful aquarium with healthy and happy fishes? I think everyone. You can easily achieve this, but only through a Biotope Correct Aquarium. The Biotope Aquarium is the future of the most beautiful and educational hobby, the aquarium. And the Biotope Correct Aquarium gives a vision, a vision of how the aquatic environments really look under the water surface. Providing such a habitat as close as possible to nature, you are going to get the best out of your fish. But not only this, it is the healthiest and most certain way to achieve healthy breeding fishes. I have been traveling for more than 50 years searching habitats in more than 200 countries and collecting fishes and plants, documenting every single detail with millions of photos, notes, films, in articles and in books. By supporting this project, you will make it possible to create an international biotope aquarium platform where every person will get access to this huge archive. This will allow you to virtually visit thousands of the remotest and most exotic places on planet Earth, from the tiniest creek in Papua New Guinea to the largest affluent of the Amazon. To build your own biotope aquarium at home and to give your fish the best home they could ever have. Also because we humans are destroying the original homes. Most of the aquatic habitats worldwide through pollution, overpopulation and industrialization. Look what is happening globally with fresh water. We can see it everywhere. We are destroying the source of all life forms, the freshwater habitats all around the globe. And once they are gone, there is no way back, because what is extinct is forever. So what can we do? The first and most important action is to educate people, especially the youngest. We must educate our kids about the importance of conservation and fresh water and everything what lives in it. That's why I find this a great idea to create a place where every person can find the information about fresh water. How the aquatic habitats really look like today. How they looked 50 years earlier. What lives in such habitats? Fish, plants, shrimps, invertebrates. How can we keep biotope correct at home? And what is most important to get the professional advice by the experts? who visited and studied these particular habitats. So guys, I hope all of you will support and become part of this Biotope Aquarium project, as I do. Thank you in advance.